No more Chuck Funk, very much broadcast the radio on YouTube. In the skeleton state, nation, itching with fungus infestation. Now I hold up this nation and mock this planet. And everything you tell me this nation did or does wrong or whatever, you did too. You do too. You did too. You did longer. You have done a lot more of it. And everywhere points a finger, you did too. Worse. You've been, wherever this place is, you've been there for this place. Failed it. And everywhere you've been, this place is green at. This is the greenest place on the globe. What a bet. Myself and some people in the restaurant the other day, we, first of all, the child broke down. Itch, itch, or the blasted fungus. Sorry. It's at me as soon as I get on here, that thing's going to attack me. Child broke down crying. I said, Supreme Court Justice. And they laughed. Then I said, undeveloped nation. They really laughed. There's no undeveloped nation here. That's a Stupidest word I've ever heard in my life. Everywhere ahead of what's, everywhere this thing is calling undeveloped, it's been there developing, is the ashes of development. Far more developed than any here or anywhere else. What's developed mean? Wet! Able to back up and remember the existence of humanity this long, and stumbling in this much right now, and what has to happen ahead. Development. Up here. Mammal. Human. Development. Higher education got development? What's the vision in their head? You think it's suckfish. Any development? What's the sense of humor? None. None! Sadistic. Vicious. Stink. Sneaky. Higher education. Walking around like this with a halo. Higher education tied into religion. Knee deep like a... Mindset of... Jesus didn't like him at all. According to the scripture. Christ sure didn't like him. Now I don't know about the other prophets, but I tell you this much. Jesus turned bright red around him, glowing red on a bad day. So red they couldn't even avoid their remarks. And this red just shined. Sure did. My grandson says I need better props. How am I going to get better than this? It's going to get, how can I represent the cosmos better than this little ball? You know how? This is about the smallest example I can hold in my hand of a cosmos that's so large that nothing here has the ability to describe it at all. If, it put, if it's of all everything in the cosmos, puts its heads and wits together, it cannot describe itself. There's more going on than it will ever have a witness or narration to. It doesn't even have the senses to do it. The senses aren't built within any of the ingredients within this to describe itself to itself. There it is, mocking that fact, and it knows it so well. Human senses certainly are not able to. Even the different frequencies that dwell there, this is just one aspect of a point something of a frequency. This is experiencing all the starlight, everything, the point something of a frequency that lives with that cosmos. And you're going to tell me you understand you have the ability to. And I'll tell you, you don't. Absolutely. You are a state of hologram and curiosity, so fragile and vulnerable and priceless and very close with all of it. You're like a... You're it! You're the cat bird seat! You got it! Cat! You're the expanding and collapsing lines of flux that you make an electron so envious it doesn't know what to say. When electrons see you, especially anything of light, it pees its pants in envy. Are you aware of that? How you function here? Are you function?
subtraction with capacitance and inductance and collapsing and expanding lines of flux. Wow! Just quit. I see you're getting full of self hair. <laughs> Fuga gave me those words and Fuga's a really sadistic. Sadistic. Oh, you think what built is kind of sadistic? Morbid sense of humor, I say. Ah! When you look at how this thing's going through feelings and just going, wow, well, like something with alamite, something's got a morbid sense of humor make it possible. What'd you say? I had the wits to build this? I call that a morbid 